with skin in the game with the young man who really had a great season. What does this even mean to get to this point for him? Well, I, I'm sure he's really, really happy with the season he's had because he's been consistent and productive. Um, he has shown that he's an important part of, the, of his team. But to be in this part of the race at this time of the year, It took a long time before the NHL returned to the Bay Area, but the Sharks have certainly made this their home. The officials there at center, and I think we are about to get this one underway. The Sharks are going to start with the puck after taking the opening draw. And just like that, from out of nowhere, comes up with the puck. The Sharks take possession in the defensive end. Moves it to tactics. gains a hold of it. Here they come up along the wing. Hurdle's got the puck in his own zone. Couture's got it against the boards. Comes up with a monster save in front. Love the way the goaltender gets tight to the shooter here. The puck's in the low slot. You want to take away time, you want to take space. Goaltender does it, makes the save. St. Louis gains a hold of the puck against the boards. Back to the point it goes. Great reflexes as he, he scores! And there it is, number 20 on the year. Well, that's a milestone, James. It isn't easy to beat the goaltenders in this league, and he's done it 20 times. St. Louis has been real aggressive right from puck drop, and look at this, Cheryl. They've got the lead as a result. Well, you know when a team is urgent, when they're closing on their opponent quickly, they're pounding pucks, and they're forcing turnovers, and then executing when they get the chance. This is a great way to start when you're the away team. And now it's grabbed by Hoffman. Made the save on the play. Gets it out of his own end. Hoffman's looking around with the point. Stops him with the glove. Subban's going to hang on for a whistle. And staying focused is key when you haven't seen a lot of work here, Cheryl. Well, part of the mental preparation as a goaltender, even when you're not busy, you have to stay dialed in, follow the action. He's doing exactly that, and makes a nice cover. The Sharks win that offensive zone faceoff. And that goes off someone in front that doesn't reach the net. They clear the zone. The Sharks have it now. Slides it across to Hurdle. Across the line and on the attack. Fires it into the offensive zone. Looking to get it out. And he gets the job done. Big thumbs up clearing that one. The power play fails to convert. They still trail by one. Moves it to the middle. Great defensive play to pick off the pass. Up along the wall on the right side and into the attacking area. And that's turned aside by Blackwood. Kyrou's running and gunning tonight, James. He got the go-ahead goal earlier, and now he's looking for more. And he denied him there. Well, a nice save by the goaltender, and even better is that he redirects the puck to the corner to safety. Tactics is across the line now and on the attack in the offensive end. Takes a whack, but still hangs on. Moves the puck into the attacking area. The Sharks have it against the wall. Slides the puck over. Quick pass to Tactics. Oh, spectacular save right there. Wow. Unbelievable. I mean, it was all but in, and he steals it because of that last-ditch attempt to find the puck. Just incredible save, James. Oh, what a save. He stopped it. Wow. Oh, that's an intangible effort that you can't teach, James. That's all about desperation and the will to stop that puck. As we look at that last save again, James, it is absolutely incredible and so impressive to see a goaltender just out-battle and out-will his opponent to find the puck. Pushes it across to Hurdle. Here's a great use of the stick right there to poke it away. Here's a short pass to Thomas. Puts it on net, denies him in front. What an incredible glove saved by the goaltender. I mean, he gets out to the top of his crease. He's challenging. He's saying, hey, try and beat me on this side. Kairos relied upon to generate chances for his team. 
tactics is great at losing defenders when he uses his spinorama zone ability to twist away from them. I'll be watching closely to see if one of those players can give their team the edge. Now back to you. Oh, what a stop as he uses his paddle to sweat it away. Shot on net, and that goes off course off a body. St. Louis moves ahead with the puck. Great cross ice pass. Piranha's got it in the offensive zone. Centering feed. Off the stick and they fall a save on the play. Oh, that's such an athletic save, James. I mean, that's just all about competing, finding a way to get to the puck. The goaltender, they have to have talent. They have to have mobility. They have to be able to track the puck, but they have to have a willingness to find it and fight for any second shot. And that's exactly what happens here. Out battling, out willing, and you make the save. Take it along the wall by Benning. Blackwood's the competitor, and he is not afraid to compete for every single puck and outwill and outbattle his opponent. And that highlight reel save, it is something, James, because just when you think it's almost in, he finds a way to get to that puck. Such an athletic goaltender. Oh, love the defensive stick work there to poke that one away. Feeds it to Hurdle. Quick feed to Tactics. St. Louis has possession of it now. Flies it over to Scandella. Oh, and he tracks it perfectly in the offensive end. How did he stop that one? This is a really nice save, James. I mean, the shooter's in the middle of the ice. He's in the slot area, and he's got to get to the top of the crease, square to the puck to be able to make that save. Great job. Here in the later stages of this period, 1-0 is where we sit at this point. All right, there's the end of period number one. We'll take a breather, a recharge. The players will too, and we're coming back with period number two right after this. Fans are back in their seats, and let's see where the action picks up here in period number two. Well, Cheryl, how do you sum this one up through the first 20 minutes? Blackwood's been fantastic in the game so far, James. I mean, he's the only reason his team is still in it. And he takes a shot. Great save by Subban. Answered the call there. Well, he has been under siege. I'm loving his compete level. I mean, he's making consecutive saves one after another. He scores! That's how you do it. Leadership to a T. The captain capitalizes. Wow, power down on that bottom hand with a flick of his wrist. As we look down on the bench, there's our young rookie who we've talked about a lot, having quite the conversation with his head coach. Well, I think this is a reminder that he's doing a real good job dictating pace, owning the puck. If you look at the possession time and the sustained pressure they've had, I think it's really important for a coach to recognize them when a rookie is playing well because confidence is everything. We're still in the early stages of this period. It's all tied up. Enters the offensive zone from the left. Great defensive play to come up with the puck. Couture's taking it from his own end. And they send it right back to him. Inside the offensive zone. Big hit and that frees up possession. And that's some great pressure in the offensive end by Hurdle. And he's ridden off the puck. Great defensive effort with the stick. St. Louis has the puck. Oh, he'll feel that one. Picked up along the boards by Clary. Sends the pass over. Turns it aside with the glove. Oh, what another stop! What a fantastic save from a high danger scoring area, James. And I mean, he's bailing his team out. They have to do a better job of protecting the middle of the ice. Centers get set as they're ready to drop the puck again. Getting closer to the halfway point of this frame. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. San Jose's won the draw and they'll go to work. Scores! The go-ahead goal puts them in front. Well, now they're in front, James, so they'll have some energy. You know that their first few strides will be more urgent, but they'll have to be accountable on the other side of the puck as well. Well, there's so much emphasis on winning face-off, James, and this is why you get possession and you get a huge opportunity quick off the draw. 
Well, the rookie's had himself a pretty good night, and it looks like even the coach agrees with that assessment. Gotta say, James, that's a great feeling on both sides for the coach to be able to give that positive reinforcement and for the player to come back to the bench and get the tap. Because you know that those earlier instructions were easier said than done, but the rookie nailed it, and they get rewarded when they get back to the bench. St. Louis is going to start with the puck after winning the draw. And he takes the feed. And that's deflected off someone in front. Vlasic's got it in the defensive end. Right to center it into the offensive zone. Here's a shot. And there's a club save on the play. The Sharks have been the better team leading in the shot department, and they lead it on the scoreboard. the draw now let's see what they can do with it played big in the moment there and that's blocked away and the puck leaves the zone they'll be forced to regroup at center feeds the puck to Ruda picking up momentum across the zone here on the right side oh steals a goal as he flashes the glove with the stop Both teams gliding into position, and the official set to drop the puck. St. Louis takes possession off the draw. The Blues have it now. Dishes it to Kairou. And they'll be forced to tag up after that missed pass. Along the boards, they battle for the puck back and forth. The Blues gain control of the puck. Moves it quickly over to Kairou. Gains the zone from the right side. Takes it into the slot. He scores! Off the defender and into the net. The Blues will play it in their own end. Moves it to the offensive zone. Fires it. Turns it aside with the glove. And the goaltender grabs that one for a whistle to try to slow things down here. Past the midway mark of the frame. We got a tie game. The Sharks get a hold of the puck in their own end. Moves it to Benning. Drives to the paint. Stopped by the goaltender. He got a little piece of that one. When that shot came quick and it was right out front, he had to be sharp. He had to be right on it and show his brilliant reflexes. won the faceoff here in the offensive zone. You'll need more than that to beat him. Subban's been dialed in right from puck drop, James. I mean, he's made the key saves that he's need to make, and it's all about for a tender managing the momentum swings of the game and the timeliness of the saves have really given his team an opportunity. Teams are ready to go, and we're about moments away from puck drop. And they win the faceoff and set up to go on the attack. Scores! The go-ahead goal puts them in front. Wow. An upward trajectory as this game's progressed and they find the back of the net. The Sharks continue to lead it here in the second period. They have been very active in the offensive zone tonight. Hurdles won the draw at center. San Jose's on the attack. Quick pass to tactics. The Blues get a hold of the puck in their own end. Here's a short pass to Thomas. The Sharks get a hold of the puck along the boards. The Blues take possession here in the open ice. Through center along the wing. He's been dangerous tonight. Two scores! And there's 39! What the 50 show! Now, to say he's been a consistent performer and goal scorer would be an understatement, James. He is a natural talent. It's amazing what he can do, but the question is, what is he going to do next? San Jose has won the faceoff at center. Tactics is got it along the wing. 
A chance from the slot. Way too much congestion blocks that. And he takes the pass. Oh, he saved it. What a stop. Well, that's desperation at its finest to be able to get to that puck and send a clear message to his team that he's behind him. He's going to be the foundation tonight. And these fans are still buzzing about what we just saw. What a save that was, Cheryl. Yeah, he made an incredible save and really engaged this fan base. They're on their feet. You know they're right into the game. And listen, when they are showing you that kind of appreciation, you also want to play for them. Well, there you go. 40 minutes in the books. All right, friends, go grab yourself some water, get hydrated, and then buckle up because we've got an exciting third period coming up in moments. Final frame is underway here. Well, Pounder, we've played more than 40 minutes now in this one. How do you view things? The Sharks are leading in this game, but I don't know if the coaches are going to like it that much, James. Everyone's cheating on the offensive side of the puck, and it's been back and forth, action-packed game. That it's all about offense. Quick shot, and that's off target as it hits a body. San Jose's got the puck in the defensive end. Quick feed to tactics. Big save in front. You have to be quick in your crease if you want to be able to deny low zone shots. He does that perfectly as he's tight to the shooter right there. Takes the pass. Moves it quickly over to Tactics. Stopped by the goaltender getting a piece of that one. That's a fantastic save by the goaltender, but his team has to do a better job of protecting the middle of the ice. Those high danger scoring chances eventually go in. And he had the answer on that one. I love the details and the time spent constantly throughout the game that we're seeing like this right here with the coach talking to the rookie and sharing instruction. Oh well, yeah, and they have a lead. So I think that this message is twofold. That one, it's when your opponent doesn't have the puck, they can't score. So continue to attack. Be relentless on the forecheck. But when you are coming back into your own zone, you got to backtrack with a purpose. you got to be defensive responsible and shut it down. Scooped up along the wall by Vlasic. In close! Fulton has spent so much time doing tracking exercises and it's utilized right here as he knows where this puck is coming from and he makes the save. Cuts into the paint! Denies him! San Jose's gained possession along the boards. Moves it around along the half wall. What a steal in his own end. San Jose's grabbed a hold of the puck. Claude save! He's on it tonight. Hammers the shot, and that goes off a body. Made the stop on the play. Oh, scores on the rebound and puts it home. The Sharks continue to attack, and then here in period number three, adding yet another goal to their score. Well, it's been all areas of the game that have really been terrific tonight, James. I've also enjoyed the communication that we're seeing on the ice, not just the body language, but also the vocalness. I mean, they're creating all over the ice, and it's been real fun to watch. Picked up along the wall by Scandella. And it's a quick pass to Hayes. St. Louis with possession in their own zone. Moves it to Hayes. Scores! And a little sign of life here on the ice as they try to get back into it. Yeah, a little bit of a move swing right here and now they've got to layer it which means they've got to have that next shift where they attack and have the mindset to drive the net. Let's see if it's sustainable now. Puck scooped up by Scandella. And they'll battle for that loose puck along the boards. Huge steal in his own end. Slides the puck into the offensive zone. Here he is on the backhand. And he makes the save on that play. Well, the shooter's in a coveted spot on the ice, right in the middle of it, with a good look, and he makes an incredible save by getting square to the puck and turning it aside. Nearing the midway mark of the period, St. Louis would love to answer back with a quick strike as they still trail by a pair. Puck grabbed by Fulk. And now it's to Kapanen. Carries the puck inside the neutral zone. San Jose's got a hold of the puck now. 
Oh, making his presence felt with a hit. Well, the game certainly isn't predictable, is it, James? As it's going back and forth, goals from all areas as players shoot from all angles and attack the zone. Here he is with the backhander. Stars! There it is! Fifth day of the year for the kid! James, I mean, you come in your first season into the league and you have that kind of confidence to hold the puck that long and to be able to shoot like that, unbelievable Fifty goals for the rookie, and to think not long ago we were wondering if he was going to make the team. Well, it's pretty incredible, isn't it? You know that the contributions that skilled players can make, but when they enter the league, it's a completely different story. The pace is different, the physicality is different. He has answered the call in every area. Shot! Huge stop by Blackwood! As a goaltender, you have to be able to read and anticipate the play. He does it perfectly and is able to negate the shot. Now he slides it up to control. San Jose, he's got a hold of it against the wall. Quick pass to Ferraro. Shot! Turned aside by Subban. Takes the feed. Here's a short pass to Thomas. Puck picked up by Buchnevich. Takes the shot. Oh, he made the save! How did he stop it? I have no idea, James. I mean, he was down and out, but profound athleticism and desperation got him back in to make it. Final minute of regulation here, and it should be it. Quick feed to Sundfist. Great stretch passes and connects. And that's poked away in the offensive zone by Kapanen. And it's kicked away. Great read by Saad. Takes a bump, but still hangs on to the puck. Now a quick pass to Crew. Oh, my goodness, it stayed out. What a save. It was all but in James, and that athleticism and the will to get to that puck, that was on display. And sure, listen to these fans here. They are getting loud. Some of them are getting on their feet here, still applauding that save we saw. James, I think it's the appreciation for the desperation save, the complete, the will to keep that puck out of the net, and they're really showing them the love. He's got it in the offensive zone. Oh, I thought he was going to be beaten, and he somehow got a piece of that. Well, all those tracking exercises when you're young come in handy when you're older, and this is a prime example. Look at him, Bob and Weave, trying to find that puck. He does and makes a save. San Jose's got it, and they're on the attack. 